Hi everyone, it's Maria. I hope you're all doing good. I'm sorry about the way I sound. I'm still sick, obviously, and it's cold. It is what it is. Um, so I'm sorry I sound really bad. <laughs> um, I'm thinking about going to the doctor first part of next week, but I, you know, I'm not doing too bad. I just I'm going through the motions of the 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 um, cold, and usually on the cold, y'all know, it takes me a while to get over, but. I'm so irritated I got it, but it is what it is, and I'll just to use uh, everything I've got and medicine-wise. So, anyway, I wanted to um, share with you my journaling Bible bag. Um, I checked my YouTube uh, channel, and I realized I didn't, um, I hadn't done a video on it. If I did, I deleted it. And I thought this might be useful for somebody who's trying to go organize. This will make a great planner bag too. Uh, I was using the Creek 365, the Mambi planner bag for my Bible journaling stuff, but I've gone back to using that for my planner supplies. And so I bought another one that looked like a binder, zip up binder with a handle on it, but it didn't hold everything in it. And even though it had like little Ziploc bags in there, um, I asked my husband if he'd take it back, and I called them because uh, I couldn't get out that day for some reason. And they had one of these left, and this is awesome. I do really love the Illustrated Faith um, bag that they've got. I think that's an awesome bag. I would like to eventually get one, but I'm pretty happy with this one. So what I have in here, and, uh, and by the way, this is, okay, did I mention Hobby Lobby? It was $15. I got it when it was 50% off. You can definitely use a coupon. Uh, the only downside is I can't fit both of my journaling bibles because I've got two that I'm working on, but that's okay. Well, I've got several, but the main two I'm working on. Okay, over here I've got pencils. Uh, I just bought a pack of pencils over there at uh, Walmart for like a dollar, so I just sharpened one. I've got this glue in here. Uh, that I got at Dollar Tree, a small hole punch. You can get it at Walmart. Uh, scissors. More glue. I think this one might be out. And I tend to Bible journal uh, in the living room or in my bedroom. Here lately it's been in my bedroom, but I like to also do it in my craft table. But I want to get an adhesive um, tape runner. I keep saying I'm going to get one. I get over there. I don't know which one to get. So um, these are just some of the pens I use. I got Hello Kitty. I got some of these other pens. Uh, I got my Bible highlighter. Just random pens and stuff. So uh, I've got some other pens scattered throughout the apartment. These are my watercolor pencils. Uh, I got it. Or artist loft ones are awesome. Uh, they're Michael's brand. They won't let you use a coupon on them, which is fine. It's five bucks. And sometimes I have this little watercolor bottle. It's an old pill bottle in there. I just took it out. Um, behind here, I've got some stickers. More stickers. Um, Mambi has come out with this. Uh, this is the Faith sticker book. This is a normal size, but they made it into a mini. I'm probably going to go ahead and get that. Because now my war binder is in a mini, and I'll show you that in just a second. And I have these things. A friend of mine sent these to me. A lot of people use them for tip-ins in their Bible. I think I'm one of the very few that doesn't. So, yeah. Um, I've just, I haven't had a chance to play with them. I think I'm going to put them in my uh, Happy Planner, though. And then I also have some cardstock in there. So, yeah, that's what I use right now. And then on the side pockets right here, I have these stickers that you can get at Walmart for like three bucks. I got some really nice ones over there, so I have those. Then I don't know what brand this is, but I got it at Hobby Lobby. Um, I got that other brand from Michaels, and then I saw these, and these are awesome. They're $18.99. I wish I knew what brand it was. But it comes with this watercolor brush, and you get the sponge, and it comes with a little ceramic dish, but I took that out, and I added another watercolor brush. And these have been awesome. This is my everything watercolor uh, anything. You know, I'll tend to take those out um, and uh, put them in my watercolor bag. If y'all want to see what's in my watercolor bag, uh, let me know. I'll, I'll show that to you. I don't know if I showed that to you. And the cool thing is these things come out right here, and you just refill them. So those. These, this has just been an awesome set, and you just buy the tubes and refill them. I've got the Artist Loft brand watercolor um, watercolors. I need to go get another one of those. And then this is one that my husband got me for Christmas. I need to use those up too. Uh, one of the journaling Bibles I'm using is the Thrive Bible. A friend of mine sent this to me. She wasn't using it, so 
Um, I was in a market for another Bible. I want to get the Inspire Bible, Praise Bible, but I haven't had a chance to look to see. I think it's right around thirty something dollars, but I'm gonna see if I can find it on sale. Some of these uh, pages or tabs that are are ones I want to work on. I just hadn't had a chance to. And this is a study Bible, but you can definitely journal in it. It's a heavy Bible. Let me tell you something. And then here's my warm binder. If y'all want to see a video on it, let me know and I'll do one. I just took what I already had and shrunk it. Love the way it turned out. And then I also have this. It's actually a cosmetics case, but I got this at Ross a long time ago. It's got my colored twistable crayons, the twistables, and then my non-twistable ones in there. Just little doodads like that. And then in the back here... Around. I've got the the uh, what do you call it the In Touch Ministries um uh what do you call it? the little devotions. A friend of mine sent those to me because I mean, she didn't know what to do with them, and she asked me if I wanted them, and I said sure. And I've been trying to get on the mailing list uh with them, but um I think they're not mailing out anymore. I don't know, but that's okay. She had the the extra ones to mail out, and if I don't feel like journaling in that Bible, I will take my Inspire Bible and journal on that. But anyway, that's just a really quick video. I'm going to get off here and go eat something. I hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you would, please. And uh, let me know if you want to see a video on my word binder and how I'm doing my Bible study now. Okay, talk to you later. Thanks for watching.